Good morning. I'm doing a review of my new work EDC bag. Um, they were throwing this out, so I actually picked it up for nothing. Part of the reason I like it is the design of the bag. Um, I just see when I'll open it of some of the options that are included with it. On this side here, we have side pouches. Give me one second to pull it out. Um, that attach. They're probably originally designed as IV pouches, but in this one on this side, I keep my neck gaiter, a hat, and a spare winter hat all in that little pouch. And then <clears throat> in this attached to the the uh, zipper part is my um, window punch slash seatbelt cutter. When you open this pouch, um, in here is uh, stuff for work. This is all my um, Stuff I would need for work includes uh, pad, paper, uh, trauma shears, regular uh, scissors, uh, stuff like that are all kept in here. I'm going to try to open this so that you can see. Uh, thermometer is also kept in there. Um, my language translators, uh, PD um, stuff along with all the stuff I would need for work oxygen wrench, tweezers uh, stuff like that is also kept in there um, we work 12 hour shifts at work so sometimes we get tied up in the truck so I keep an extra uh, food pouch and in that food pouch this is a smaller one this is my everyday go to if I need in there is a uh, some people may hate me, but there's Spam, there's uh, Cliff Bars, there's Tuna Fish, along with the utensils, Hardtack Candy, stuff like that kept in this one. Um, as you can see, it's enough to get me by my shift if we don't get time to stop to eat. I also keep in my work EDC bag my SAS Survival Manual. And then when you open the bigger zipper section, which I absolutely love this bag for that, um, you will see everything lays out pretty perfect. Um, on this side is uh, survival cards up in the top here. In this pouch on this side. Um... Most of this stuff I had in other videos, but I wanted to show it again. I carry a Bible uh, marker up in here. Uh, so, mini sewing kit. In the center one here, I keep my uh, two handheld flashlights, a helmet light, uh, miscellaneous over-the-counter meds in this one, ear, pl ear plugs, uh, two rolls of mini duct tape, pencil sharpener, I keep uh, dice for entertainment value, pocket knife, um, women's feminine hygiene product is also in here, uh, and this side is my another thermometer which will do head readings, uh, sharp shuttle along with my EpiPen, uh, Gatorade, three bottles uh, for when I'm at work, this one here is uh, the uh, candle uh, Trivex suit or uh, stove uh, with some extra fuel. Uh, some more fire starter stuff in that little tin, which is an Altoids tin. Rain poncho, a head cover, along with a neck wrap to keep uh, cool. To these uh, red things I picked up when we were at the Prepper X uh, meet and greet along with diggers. That's where I picked these up at one and then I went out and bought more. 
Um, this pouch here is my um, binoculars, a cheap set. There's hand sanitizer along with sunblock in there in that pouch. And this one here is uh, orange webbing, pink webbing. Uh, some extra straps to make additional fastening points, a roll of electrical tape, along with uh, 550 cord. Uh, my other food pouch, this one on this side is a lot more detailed. Uh, that's about 72 hours or longer worth of food in case I would get stuck at work. Hygiene items. Uh, uh, masks depending on where we're at, uh, vomit bag, extra EMS equipment in this pouch here, um, from, uh, stuff that we may need handy, that we may not always be able to get to a bag if I needed, uh, this black pouch is my active shooter pouch, and here is a, uh, two cat tourniquets, along with, uh, chest seals, um, Stuff like that is all kept in here. On this side is my blood pressure cuff and stethoscope. Um, and that's pretty much what's in my bag. Uh, it's not 100% sure. And I've done uh, reviews of some of my other stuff that I carry in it. Uh, I'm not fully done. And I'm still making up uh, some other stuff for this bag. But I wanted to share and let you see what the bag looks like and uh, show you how it's working out for me because it actually has the shoulder straps on it which is nice and then on the top here I have my uh, extrication gloves of pulled socks extrication gloves my uh, pulled socks which has a rubber booty around it um, a uh, survival bracelet slash uh, watch a survival bracelet um, mini uh, tool along with um, military uh, can openers are in this little CPR mask shield along with uh, barrier device and gloves stuff like that uh, like I said it's not a full detailed list but it gives you a rough idea what I carry in my work bag uh, realizing that I cannot carry any type of firearms when I'm at work because it is illegal in our state um, I've added uh, even coffee filters, so if I need it to filter my water, I can. Um, but the only thing I don't have yet in, in here, and I'm probably going to work on getting, is a water filtration system set up. But I do have, like I said, uh, three bottles of Gatorade. They're smaller ones, but uh, typically this is made for a 12-hour shift at work. So if I'm in the truck and cannot get back to station, I have stuff with me. Or if we get a prolonged incident. Um, if you have questions, feel free to post it below the video, and I will try to answer it. Thank you, and have a great day.